Hey, welcome back to the Cable Data Science Channel. This is part two and a half, 2A, at the BIM for analysis for the New York cases and deaths. Uh, this is going to be very brief. We're going to load the library, of course. We're going to create a test set. We're going to plot the first digits of the test set. Uh, the green lines are the expected values. The red the red crosses are the um, the red crosses are the uh, actual values. So you can see the the actual numbers down here fit this pretty well. And you can see here for the first nine digits, the highest number here is twenty nine percent for the actual numbers. Okay. So let's come down here, set a new seed. Pull out the first case's data. Let's compare this. So, this is right. Okay. Now, this is New York cases. Again, the expected values and the and the and the red and the red crosses are the uh, are the actual values. You can see that New York cases is very close to what's expected. Now, let's take like a DESA. First digit again. Okay. Once again, the expected values, 31%. The actual values are well below that number. And the highest percentage here is, is 1 1.1, 4.6, 2.2, 0.9. So the highest number here is actually 1.1 percent. Wow. Wow. <laughs> okay. So there's actually a second test that we get to in, in part three of this video. Uh, this is the what's called the first digit analysis. The part two, we will we will analyze the first two digits plus a few extra reports and numbers. Okay. Thanks so much for your time. Hope you found this interesting and useful. Uh, this report comes without any any guarantee or guarantee for usefulness. Uh, this is uh, this is a very basic analysis of New York's numbers, cases and deaths for the New York State. So anyway, I hope you found this report a little interesting. If not, well, I'll try better next time. Thanks so much for your time.